Hey guys. Hey guys. I kind of hate saying that. Like, I want something else to say, not hey guys, because there's girls and guys. And then in between. So I really don't know what to say. If you can think of something that I should say, let me know. Um, today I'm going to be eating because I'm stuffed. I had a really heavy dinner, so <laughs> just snacking today. And it's like, I don't even know what time it is on Sunday night. But I wanted to bring you guys a video because I've been getting so much positive feedback and it honestly makes me really happy. Um, I just blinded myself by looking at this bright ass light. <laughs> my setup is so ghetto like i don't even know it's on a like my ipad is on a chair leaned up against a timberland boot box with a five pound weight in front of it <laughs> and I have a lamp right next to me it's super ghetto anyway so i am going to be eating and not the whole thing because that's just ridiculous but i'm gonna snack on some cheese some mozzarella cheese and some genoa salami they're both pre-cut so no work for me and some of these bagel things i couldn't find the other ones like they're like i don't know like hard cracker hard crackers because they're soft crackers right i don't know the ones that you eat like with salami and stuff i don't know what i mean gonna find those so i got the bagel chips and they were on sale and i like buying stuff that's on sale mm. i love salami and cheese. Not together, it could be separate. I just love both of them. Fuck the both of those. Anyway. Mm. So, oh. I am a mess. I started a new job on Tuesday. And I've been thinking about what you guys would want to talk about. And I think that I should talk about my new job because don't we all start a new job at some point and don't we all like get jobs that we absolutely hold on i can't even open this like i think i opened it wrong i just cut through all the slices of cheese can you see that like a couple I'm so clumsy. Mm. I love food. So, I had, okay, I started this new job on Tuesday. I like it so far. It's good, thank God. Because I've been looking for a job for like 10 years. And I got hired at a couple other places like a few weeks ago. Literally, two jobs in two days did not last. The first place I'll tell you about was at a plumbing company. I'm not a plumber. But you know, like administrative stuff, gotta have the balsamic. And well, this fucking place did not turn on the air conditioning. And it was in an office in Manhattan. I'm sure they made plenty of money and would not turn on the AC. So I'm looking at the girl next to me and I'm like, at what point in the day do they turn on this air conditioning? Because I'm sweating balls right now. And she's like, they don't. Excuse me? It's fucking 85 degrees outside. You have ceiling fans on. You don't turn on the AC? I didn't say that, but I'm thinking it. Because she was cool, you know? So I'm like, um, what? Why? Why not? She's like, well, it bothers the owner's nose. I don't give a fuck about the owner's nose. You have like 20 employees. I'm exaggerating, but you have employees in the office who need to work. And you cannot be productive in your job if there's like no adequate air, right? So I'm annoyed because this mofo didn't come in until two o'clock in the afternoon. You could have had the AC on until then. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I still burn a napkin. I didn't do a fucking napkin. Mm. Cheese, crust. melt in your mouth. So good. So, I might sand. Just stick it out. You know, you'll be alright. 
then they're teaching me their system and I'm at that point in my life where I can choose where I want to be like I have enough experience to say fuck this I'm not working here this is some bullshit I found a floppy disk in one of the drawers what the fuck are you doing with a floppy disk in a drawer do they still sell those I don't know and I'm like what the fuck I'm like why do you have a floppy disk I don't know my light is like smoking Anyway, so the girl's like, I don't know what she fucking said. So then I'm like, do you have a stapler? Because I had no supplies at all. She opens up a cabinet. There's like three highlighters, one pen, and a fucking thing of white out. My okay. So like I said, they were teaching me the system. And the way they were doing things was so unorganized and so redundant. Long story short, I was annoyed. And I went to the owner because he said, oh, come and talk to me if you have any concerns, blah, blah, blah. So I'm like, listen, I don't know if I'm c- cut out for this job. Like, this company is very unorganized, and you have me doing things that are very redundant, and I don't understand why. I've been here 40 years. We're not unorganized. And I'm like, yes, you are. And yeah, I have balls like that. Like, I don't give a fuck. If I see something that's not working, I'm going to let you know. Mm. Mm. He's like, maybe it's just too much work for you. I'm like, it's not. It's redundant. He goes, goodbye. I say, thank you, goodbye. And I walked out. Don't talk to Then the next day, I started some weird place. It wasn't for me. Like, the job itself, it was not I wasn't familiar with the field so it was very new to me and I honestly kind of felt like shit because it sucks to start over again like when you've learned so much about a certain field and then you go into something else it's like oh my god I don't know this I have to start from the bottom and it was just like really annoying you have to clock in clock out if you go to the bathroom you gotta fucking clock out go get coffee clock out I'm like no you're not tracking every fucking minute of my day because then that's taking money away from me and what that's putting more money in your pocket because i went downstairs to grab a cup of coffee that's disgusting to me like you have to be a really selfish person to make people do that so i left at two o'clock mm. not good no thank you no thing i'm not interested mm. i'm like I've had so many jobs. I'm not even lying. So many jobs. Since I started working when I'm 15. Supermarkets, fast food, you know, as a high school student. I just don't like taking shit from people. We do one thing I don't like, I'm like, peace out. Chopping up the deuces. I worked at Steve Town, Radio Shack, Wendy's, Burger King, Key Food, FYE. Used to be called the Mustard, it turned into FYE. What else? I don't know. I've had like office jobs. I've had a whole bunch of jobs. Obviously, now that I'm older, you know, I try to stay at one place for a long time. But I like change. I don't know. Like, it gets really miserable when you're doing the same thing every fucking day it's like oh my god kill me like there's no surprise you know like you go to work and you know what's coming same faces same computers same software i don't know sometimes i feel like i was meant to do more but i don't know what that is so it really sucks. It really does. And you gotta make money, so. I'm not eating this for the video. I'm just like, you know, I'm eating it because it's delicious. And I'm gonna eat it anyway. So I figure, why not record? My light bulb is like smoking. 
few light bulbs do that. Like, on a daily basis, just smoke. I don't fucking know, but I don't have a fire extinguisher. I have a fire escape. But I don't have a fire extinguisher. Hmm. I went to Walmart today. I didn't really get much to the Sunday. And that place was packed. Like, family go there on Sunday. Really miserable. Like, they bring their whole family for a day at Walmart. Why? I get it. Like, Walmart's fun, whatever. But no. I could really eat this whole thing of cheese and salami right now. I'm disgusting. I'm really fucking disgusting. I'm gonna cook. I curse too much. That's just me. And I'm, I'm not gonna change because someone with baby ears is watching. If you don't like someone who's vulgar and like blunt, just click off of my video. I appreciate you watching me and commenting and subscribing. I, I was like ecstatic when I hit 100 subscribers. You don't even know. Like, I'm just so, so thrilled that at least one person, even like one person, if I can make some laugh or smile or whatever, that makes me so happy. I've always been that type of person. Like, I just want people to, I want to make people laugh and be happy and like talk with me and say, yeah, I agree with that. Or I just agree with that. I like that. I like, I like stuff like that. But you know, you don't have to watch my video. So if you like me, I love you. And if you don't, just please click off. Don't leave, like, nasty comments. I mean, you're going to have, like, haters or whatever. Or just weirdos. There's a lot of freaking weirdos on YouTube. I get that. They can't help themselves. But I just ignore them. I've had some really weird comments on my videos I've had to delete. Stuff that I don't even want to say on here. Because it's so perverted. Disgusting. Like, people masturbating to my videos. Come on. That's horrible, but, you know, whatever. I can't do shit, because I'm putting myself out here, so. But thank you so much for just watching my videos and interacting with me, asking me questions. I respond to everybody who comments, for the most part. And someone was like, oh, you're pronouncing it wrong. Well, I'm not Korean. I don't fucking have Korean friends, and everyone on YouTube says it different. People are like, Mak -pa. Mak -pa. Mak -pa. Mak -pa. I don't fucking know, so I'm gonna pronounce it the way that it's spelled in English. If you wanna make a video and tell me the correct pronunciation, then go ahead. I wanna learn, I wanna say it right, I want you to be happy when I say that word, because it is your language, and I want to say it right, because when you speak my language, and you don't say it right, you're the best. Speak English, the right word. Ah! Okay. Okay. I don't give a shit. This light bulb is smoking right now, so I'm going to end this video, and try not to burn my apartment down. Toodaloo.